Hi guys, welcome to Simple Programming. In this video, let us look at Pivotal's web console. In order to use the Pivotal's web console, you need to register first. The registration is quite simple and you can do it in few minutes. It just asks for a email verification. Once that is done, you can directly log into your web console and take a look at the console that is available for you to make use of. Once you log in, you will be taken to the home page of the web console. Pivotal gives you a trial account which you can make use of for your development activities or your e-learnings. The home page as an organization, you can create multiple organizations here and you have spaces. Currently, I have two spaces under simple programming. One is development and production. The next, we have the markets place. The markets place is where you get all your software providers which you can use as a service for your applications. There's quite a list of available softwares here which you can really make use of. If your service that you're looking for is not available here, right? For example, let's say Cassandra is not available as a direct managed service. If it is not available, then you have to install Cassandra or configure Cassandra through Pivotal's Ops Manager and make it available as a user-defined service in the marketplace which your application can make use of. You can also have a PCF dev in your local machine. That is, you can install Pivotal Cloud Services in your local machine directly and then make use of this particular web console. PCF dev is a small footprint of distribution for Pivotal Cloud Foundry. It is intended to run locally on a developer machine. But for this example, we are going to use the, uh, you know, the web console. Apart from the marketplace, we have the documents. When you click on the documents, it will take you to the Pivotal's document reference uh, website. Then you have the support details, the tools, which is to kickstart and there's a tutorial for you to, you can make use of. Then there's a blog where you can go and put in your questions or discuss different things about Pivotal Cloud Foundry. Then there's status. When you click on status, it will open a new browser with all the metrics and health monitors for different uh, services and applications available. With this, we have completed the web console video. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos.